Okay guys, so I am midway through the um, the wig and I'm telling you, when you get to this part right here, I changed needles. Okay, because at the beginning you can see I was having a hard time getting this needle through the west. So I went with a smaller needle. Let me show you it. This is the smaller needle that I went with. Okay, and it's very pointy. But these bad boys, these wefts right here, they bad. Let me tell you, you got to put your back into it to get that through there. So that's why I went off camera, but I wanted to come back so I can let you guys see where I'm at. So all I'm doing is just going back and forth, flipping it, and then right here, I um, <laughs> I had to struggle to get this to um to lay down flat. So I'm going to go ahead and keep on going and look at these beards on this baby. Can y'all see that? Can you see that? Let me move you closer. Look at the beards on this. That is freaking awesome. I'm telling you how tight these wefts are. You ain't going to have no, um, you ain't going to have no shed and I, I done ran my hands through here. I don't know how many times because the dang on here is so freaking gorgeous. I can't help myself. So, let me keep on going and uh, do what I do on this baby. Uh, and then you can, I'm not even done. This is the first, this is the first bundle. And this is how much I got left to go. See? I still got this right here so I already know I'm I'm not gonna run out of no hair and it's really you can't even see the um the tracks you see that Ooh, baby Alright, so this is the easy part. I'll be back when I get around there to the other side and I got to flip it over so you can see how I have to do it, okay? Be right back. Okay guys, so I'm getting ready to um flip it. So let me put this last stitch. Get this last stitch in here. Okay. Let's flip the old girl over. Gonna take it. You gonna mash it in, cause these wefts, uh, yeah. So you getting ready to see right now. Okay. So now that lays nice and flat right there. You see what I have to go through to get that thing up in there? All right, so this is gonna be my last, um, my last uh, flip over, and then I'll have 
this much left this I'm gonna have to cut off this is how much I'm gonna have to cut off from the first bundle and then we're going to the next bundle but that bundle um, has got to be colored first and then uh, I can continue on with this so let me just show you the back of her See that? See how pretty she is? Alright y'all, I'll be back. Okay guys, so um, as you can see I have started with the blonde color. And I'm going to just come in little closer so you can see the transition of that okay so it's going to be really pretty and the west on this one I'm not having that much difficulty getting the um, needle through that so just wanted to come through so you guys can see that I'm working with the blonde now. As I get closer to the top, I'll come back and um, just view it, let you view a little bit more. Okay? So I will see you beauties and bowls in the next segment. Bye bye. Okay, beauties and bowls, I'm back. Um, I'm at the top of the wig now so this is the part that most people really want to see the back part is pretty easy so and I'm gonna speed it up now but I'll put it at a pace where you can still understand what I'm doing all right so here we go right here I pull down like anywhere you feel that you want it closer to that other track I just put a little pressure there and tack it down right there just like that all the way around Okay guys, I'll be back um, after I get finished. So you can see pretty much how I'm going. Just going around, flipping it, and then coming back. So I'm just going to make it really, really small because I want to leave just a little bit of my hair out. So I'll be back um, probably with the finished product. Okay? Alright, beauties and bows. I'll see you soon. Okay, beauties and bowls. So I'm finally done with my wig. And I'm just going to go ahead and take it off the um, mannequin head. And cut it.
instead of cutting it um, instead of cutting it band off I think I'm just gonna sew it down so yeah I'm gonna just um, this part right here this this here I'm just gonna sew this down to the wig cap itself instead of cutting it off I want to try something different all right so I let you know how that works out okay I will see you beauties and bows once I have this attached to my head all right love you much bye bye